So one recently, she said I could talk about her case, I'm not going to mention names. This nice woman had a positive Lyme ELISA, which is the screening test, and between two and four bands on her western blot, but didn't meet the five-band reporting criteria, which the CDC says there's ten times as many cases out there as meet the strict reporting criteria that a lot of doctors go by. And IDSA advocates for using CDC reporting criteria, even though CDC doesn't advocate for that. Right. So, she had this positive Lyme test, but it wasn't the full reporting criteria. For nine years, the Western blot was up and down. She said, and her husband, who's an attorney, said, oh, the doctor said, this looks just like Lyme. I wish I could treat you. I wish I could treat you, but the test isn't fully positive. She ended up getting severe dementia, not mild or moderate, severe dementia. Her mini mental status exam is, is very bad. She lost, I would say, 90% of her vision in, a, in a, a, an occipital kind of blindness. It's a, a blindness that occurs in the brain, not in the eyeball. She is completely disabled, not just from her job, but every aspect of her life. And so, no, it's not always just mommy brain fog and joint pain. I wish it was all like that.